Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on when you're listening. It's Back to Basics months here over Fit Over 40, and I've got a good one for you in this video. It's what I personally do to keep my nutrition dial in, so I feel covered for the week and prepared. But before I dive in, I'm Coach Clarence with Fit Over 40, and I help men and women over 40 achieve health, wealth, and the best mindsets to live the best lives in their 40s and beyond. All right. So I'm going to be sharing my weekly meal game plan in this video so you can see an example of just how easy it can be to be successful with your meal planning and planning for the week. So after talking with my clients, I know many people feel overwhelmed and confused about exactly what they should do. So they just kind of make it up as they go along every day, but I really have a plan. They kind of wing it, if you will. So we're going to talk about how you don't have to wing it. So my game plan works for me because it fits my goals and my routine. So while a couple of details might not work for you, they might give you a few ideas to help you streamline your own game plan. So what I do is every Sunday, I create a plan for the rest of the week with two to three different breakfasts, lunches, and dinners. It's so much easier. You might be surprised to learn I don't create a full meal plan, but instead have more of a template that works no matter what okay breakfast is either a smoothie or some eggs example lunch is leftovers from the night before and i batch cook three dinner options on sunday and wednesday afternoon so that my fridge is stocked i build every meal around a basic protein source i always make extra dinner so i can eat it for lunch tomorrow I will tell you this is when hiring meal prep services is also invaluable. As you know, I provide meal prep services for my clients as well. Okay, my refrigerator is one of my hardest working appliances in the whole entire house, okay? Because I keep so many leftovers for use later. My dinners follow the old standby, a good source of protein, some veggies, depending on what my meal plan needs that day. Sometimes I have a starchy carb in there. Knowing and tracking your numbers will help you see trends and where you're lacking and see what patterns are holding you back or moving you forward. It's very important to track, not to be a nuisance, but it shows you patterns and you can see where you can fix what you're doing. Do any of you guys have a game plan for your meals for the week or do you just wing it? Let me know in the comments below. If you're looking for ideas for your meals, you're going to want to check out my meal prep service if you live in the Phoenix area. Or message me here so we can discuss your specific numbers. You'll learn how to eat accordingly to your goals without feeling deprived. That's super important. A lot of people feel deprived when they try to get healthy. You shouldn't. You should be that you feel natural and normal. And we can talk about that personally. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if it's your first time on this channel. And hit that like button. It helps our channel out. If you're watching this on Facebook, be sure to like it and share it with someone who might find it helpful. Okay, I hope this helped you as well. I'll talk with you guys soon.